Okay, today we're going to show you how to make a chorus. So, start with input, output, control pot one. Let's just start with that. I'm going to go get a LFO chorus. This is just the simplest chorus you can use. Just wire that straight from here to there. And we'll put a pot to the speed and we'll put another pot on the width which is the second control there and then we'll go in here and take a look at the settings course time is 16 that's fine let's leave it like that let's speed up the the rate and let's give it some additional room to get kind of weird and see where we like it so I'll even take this higher Eight, okay. So okay, so bot zero. Okay. So notice that when it's all the way on the left, there's no there's no action at all because the LFO is actually at zero. So, I'm going to turn up the LFO. We hear it start to warble now. This is full wet through this chorus block, so this is actually vibrato at this point. And I can... Turn the width down to, to get what seems like it. Okay. Instead, I'm going to put one of the outputs here directly from the input, and then I'm going to double check that I have mono selected. And there's, we'll do different things later. But this is just to mix both things together there. And okay, so that gives you more of the traditional type sounds as you see. Alright, that's interesting. And let's just see. Well I sort of favor I sort of favor slow LFOs, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn this down a bit. I'm going to make the rate, maximum rate, something like 3. Then I'll put a scale offset in here. Reset. Like I always do. Alright, not just that. For 1 up here, of course, because I want it to go to the max. And then here I'll have it go to like a 3 to 1 ratio, about. Let's try this. is a little excessive there. Right. Deal with less width. Let's try and get less width in there and see what happens. opportunity so anyway that's your classic kind of chorus sound there and here's here's an opportunity that I take a lot of times when I'm trying to build something a little bit more complex I'm going to delete this and then I'm going to put in another scale offset here and what this is going to do is this is going to turn the width up as as the speed goes down and vice versa so there's a there's an inverse relationship between the two things and and that gives you kind of a chorusing sound that's you know okay or optimized at a range of frequencies so let's just see this so this is 10 to 32 so one way of doing it is just go okay uh, we'll do one and then down to the same 32 let's just try that and see what happens Okay, 
wave. So, so the width goes up as the uh, slider goes down. The... So let's just listen to that a little bit more. Actually, want the maximum LFO speed to maybe be a little less. Really like slow speeds and maybe turn the width up a little bit. Let's just see. sounding chorus. Now, I'm going to also show you how you can make it easily into stereo. Okay, again, go up here, get a 2 to 1 times 2 mixer. Alright, so this has got two 2 to 1 mixers, and we're going to take the input into here and here. Get that out of the way. And we're going to take the chorus into here, and then we're going to go up here and get a phase invert. Put that there. And then we're going to take this and we're going to make it not mono anymore. Let's see what happens now. It's a nice range of sounds over some different LFO speeds. And so, just to summarize, I control the maximum speed over here in the chorus. Maybe I'll try a little bit more, more delay times. see there are there are so many combinations of stuff that you can get here that you can really individualize your chorus sound so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to bust out a different chorus block which is the four voice chorus and this has built-in four phases of uh, output voices so uh, we'll just we'll just take those all right in there and then at this point we're not going to even have any dry signal blended in it's all going to be these four chorus voices let's let's try this out and uh, let's just double check the speed here of course time tap one okay man look at all these controls so you can actually okay speed that up a bit LFO rate let's make that 3.7 uh, chorus time we made that a little bit longer there let's just see well, that's pretty that's pretty wild So I think I want the, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, the minimum speed to be less. So turn down that. So I think I'm going to turn down the width a bit here, the maximum width. So with that, I'll control the maximum width here. Try that. Yeah, that's a pretty cool sounding chorus. Let me just set that to mono just to see what happens because I am going to make it mono for my mono pedal.